All right, this is free to play Otis, and the new event just happened. The new, uh, sorry, the new objective just dropped, and um, it's just to block a couple of hits with anti venom. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna uh, fight a champion that has a special one that has a bunch of hits, and that's gonna be Joe Fix It as a four star, um, just so I can get a couple hits on him whenever I I need power or something. Um, whenever I need to uh, toss him up against the wall or whatever it is I need. So, I'm going to get my three-star anti-venom. And we're going to hop right in and try and get those 15 hits on the first try. I'll, I'll see if I can count them. I, I, I kind of doubt it. Okay. So that's two... I, I I couldn't count that. <laughs> I have no idea how many that is. Okay, cool. Well, I probably shouldn't have dexed. So I'm throw another special one just for good measure. Okay. Hopefully that was enough. We'll see if we got the challenge. I think we did. Yeah, we did. Okay, that was easy. It's not that bad. I mean, it sounds like, you know, okay, 15 hits, that could be... You know, that could be kind of annoying, but it, it, it could be relatively quick if you know who to fight. So, we're going to go to the Cosmic Eclipse quest on Legendary Difficulty. And this time we're going to do quest number one. Uh, and this is going to be the Tier 5 CC and the Tier 4 uh, Class Catalyst Crystal, uh, along with the 10 Clintar Catalyst. So, what we're going to do is we're going to hop in with uh, Black Widow Clairvoyant as well as She-Hulk uh, just because those two champions never let me down so it's a different fight from last time it's Hood, Howard the Duck and Agent Venom so Hood is going to be when inflicted with Diva this different has a 50% chance to purify that's it, just tenacity So it, it's really not going to be that bad of a fight. Um, I'm actually, I'll just I'll just hit it with uh, She Hulk. Okay. Okay, that tenacity is going to be a little, a little, little bit annoying. Definitely don't want him getting to a special two. So far, he's not really purifying that much. He's rarely purified any of my stuns. Okay, that was a pretty quick fight. 51 hits. I remember with the Black Widow Clairvoyant fight, I was I was finishing the fights with like a hundred and something hits. It's something crazy. Uh, maybe they scale up in difficulty as you go through the the chapters, as you go through the quest. But I'll well, I guess I'll find that out as I go through it. So with She-Hulk's Awaken ability, she pretty much uh, ignores, I think, like a good chunk of the armor off of the opponent. I need to stop talking while I'm trying to parry. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, I should have waited for a special one. I'm not gaining any furies for some reason. The RNG is just really bad. Come on, buddy. Okay. Just a little annoying that he's not throwing specials and I'm not gaining any furies. Yeah, I'm not getting any furies. That's 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 really crazy. I think in the past like like 20 hits I haven't gained a single fury. I know that if I throw special ones, I'll get furies, but in the last match, I didn't do that, and I got like seven. Alright, so I just made a couple mistakes in that fight, but, but generally how with the duck is easier to fight. I think if I would have brought in Captain Marvel movie, that this it probably would have been a lot better. Um, but the last fight is just an Agent Venom. It's probably gonna have um, oh let's see what we have. Seven nodes. Uh, all abilities trigger 50% more often. Uh, every two seconds gain a prowess. Extinction protocol. The inevitable extinction grants the defender 200 attack based on how full the my power bar is. Uh, when I when they activate a special attack, the combat power rate increases by 15%. Okay, ebb and flow knockdown. The defender has protection, reducing all incoming damage by 60%. Knocking the defender down removes the protection and grants the attacker with a passive fury, increasing attack rating by 40% for 12 seconds. When the fury expires, the protection returns and all debuffs on the defender are purified. Oh, okay, so I need to be constantly like knocking him down. Gain shin charge, at 10 charges all, re all are removed and gain an armor up. So this just, it's just really annoying. That when they have an armor up, they gain 65% attack rating and they become unblockable. Oh my God, yeah. No, I definitely should have brought a, a good armor break champion for this one. Um, we're, we'll go in with She-Hulk and see how long she lasts. <laughs> I just I like had to cheese that. Oh come on, I definitely dexed that. And if I didn't dex it, then I, I blocked it at least. You gotta be kidding me. The game over here pretending like I took my finger off the screen. <laughs> okay, well that's that's that was an interesting first run. Oh, sh 
shit. I should have stayed in. Okay. That was a lot. <laughs> that was a lot of bleed damage. Um, that sucks. I have to use resources now. That's what I didn't want to do. Yeah, I know. Definitely come prepared whenever you guys do do this fight. Um, I would definitely, I would say, like, bring an Apocalypse. Um, I think Apocalypse and uh, Captain Marvel movie, Medusa, probably be good champions for this. Um, but let's see, let's see how we do with this. At least she can kind of nullify buffs. Um, uh, let's see how it works. Okay, we're gonna stay in the poison phase this time. Yo, those hit really hard. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, I'm totally unprepared for this fight. I, I really shouldn't have brought in Black Widow Clairvoyant. This is really not a good matchup for her. Um, I def definitely should have brought in like Apocalypse or something. And yeah, there's no way I'm, I'm quitting out of this fight. Okay. Um, wow, this, so far this has sucked. <laughs> Pretty bad. But this is why I guess you watch videos before you, you go into the quest, uh, so you know who to bring. I, I'm just going to start blocking the special ones. Yeah, no, I should I should have blocked that. I, I tried to dex it again. This is just a super annoying fight. Oh, yeah, no, that unblockable really made it kind of dumb. Um, I'm trying to throw them to special tubes because I know I could dex those. Um, yeah, I'm going to start using level 2 revives. This is really bad. I don't think I'm, I'm going to do this quest again. <laughs> I don't think it's worth the 1% tier 5 CC unless I unless I bring in like an apocalypse or something. Because at least he has negative 100% ability accuracy for uh, purifying. down the oh my gosh 
Oh, I definitely dashed back. I definitely dashed back. I saw him coming. <laughs> I barely have him down to 50%. Alright, that was my last health potion. Um, let's try to do a little bit more work on this one this time. Oh my god, that's a that's huge attack. That is really huge attack. I hate getting intercepted like that. <laughs> wow, that is a lot of attack. 10,000. Alright, well that was my last health potion. I probably should have used that with like a level 1 revive. Wow, I can't believe I'm gonna use, I've used this many resources on a side quest. I'm definitely not gonna do this quest again. <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> I don't know why I tried to do a heavy attack there. But he has 90,000 more health. I have, you know, just a couple more revives left. Oh, this is turning out to be a much longer fight than, than in my previous video. I wish it was an intercept node instead. Throw that so I can get him to a special two. Okay, that that was a decent run. That was a decent run, um, but he just his the tenacity is just way too strong. Every time I throw off a special tool, he always takes off that buff immunity. <laughs> And then my regen is just not strong enough. I keep, <laughs> I need to learn to dash back only once. Yo, I'm pretty sure the AI can't. Oh, come on. <laughs> that was pretty bad. If I would have dashed back twice, I would have been too far to, to, to get off a special. Or sorry, a heavy attack. But if I dash back once, then I get hit by the heavy attack. I, I don't know. That, I'm, I'm confused. <laughs> We're almost there. 32,000 health. It shouldn't be that bad. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, Perry issues. Come on, game. Come on. It's like the game knew I was on my last level 2 revive. And they just wanted me to get rid of it. <laughs> Yo, that sucks. She just stood there and got hit. There we go. Okay, so a couple of revives later, uh, I was totally unprepared for this fight. Um, but at least we got our <laughs> our one percent of a tier five CC. Yay! Uh, so we need four more Clintar catalysts left to um, take up our summon symbiote to rank two, and then I'll probably be able to do that that side quest. Um, but let's see what this tier five. Class Catalyst gets us. I'm hoping for Cosmic. And it's skill. Alright, sure. Why not? I'll take that. Uh, yesterday I actually pulled a 6-star Strife. So that's that's going to be interesting. I'm actually hoping now to get a little bit more um, mutant material so I can so I can bring them up. But anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, now that you guys have seen this video, hopefully you guys don't make the same mistake that I do. And, uh, you know, just, just come to that fight prepared. But... I'll see you guys in the next one.